In the last video, we saw how to create vectors. Recall, vector object is sequence of elements of same class type. What if our vector contains elements of mixed class types or different class types? Let's see through an example. I define an, a vector object vmixed with the help of C function and I, I, I give integer and character. Okay, let's see what is the class type of this vector by using class function on vmixed. It shows that the output correct that the output vector has the class type of character. Notice that we had integers, we also had characters, but the output type or class type of this vector is character, and that is because internally R coerced or converted uh, the class type of all the elements to a single class type, and this is called coercion. To see what happened behind the scenes, let's go and see uh, see uh, the help file of C function. So, in cases when we have mixed class type, the output class type is determined from the highest type of components in the hierarchy. So this is the hierarchy we have, whichever uh, class type is higher in this hierarchy takes the preference and all the other other elements uh, the class type of other elements are converted to this class type in our example we had integer and we also had character and if we see character is higher higher in this hierarchy and hence uh, the class type of all the rest of the uh, elements are were converted into character class type let's put this hierarchy in the R console so that it helps you in other examples. Okay, let's take another example. Next two. This time we will take integers and logical elements. Okay. We see that all the elements are converted to integer class type and the reason is because if we see the hierarchy integer is higher in the hierarchy as compared to the logical class type let's take another example this time we will take logical and complex And we see that all the elements are converted to complex class type. This is because the complex class type is higher in hierarchy as compared to logical uh, class type. So this is uh, basically um, what coercion is. And just to summarize, um, when uh, we have a vector of uh, a vector of elements uh, with mixed class type what R does is basically uh, um, R would coerce the um, class types and the output is determined from the highest class type of components in, in this hierarchy. I hope this helped in understanding the um, coercion property um, in R. Thanks.